Garden fork is a tool which can be used to till or turn over the soil, thereby bringing the subsoil to the surface. Storage area. The tool is first selected according to the type of tillage that is proposed, deep or shallow, primary or secondary. Prongs facing down the garden fork is taken to the site. Hand and body position becomes important in proper handling. The fork is positioned in front of the person who must have a firm stance. Using one hand, the fork is firmly gripped at the top handle. The hand holds the middle to upper area of the length of the fork loosely. Important to note that the grip of the top hand must be firm as this is where the power for sticking the fork in the ground comes from. Fork is then lifted to about knee height, keeping in mind hand and body positions. Quick thrust, the fork is sunk into the soil and kept at right angles with the surface. Tilting can result in plowing at an uneven depth and the fork picking up an inadequate amount of soil. The person places his foot on the shoulder of the fork and using body weight rocks the fork back and forth so that it sinks to the desired depth in the soil. Feet off the fork, the fork, both hands at the handle at the top and body weight transferred to where the hands are. Spit of soil or clod is levered or broken away from the unplowed area. Top hand remains holding the handle while the other hand firmly grasps the middle of the fork. The clod is gently lifted, holding the fork firmly. Then turned over and placed at the side, outside the plowing area. The tape previously described is continued, removing as many spits of soil as the plower may find convenient, forming a furrow. Continued in the next row, placing the inverted soil in the first furrow and creating a second. This activity continues until the plot is plowed. garden fork is washed, dried, and greased, and then returned to the storage shed.